Let's talk about Underworld. This is okay. your third time is. playing Celine. Yes. And uh, first of all, a very uh, great action uh, in, in these movies. And I look at these films and I think, you must know now how to really kick some ass. You must, huh, it looks sure. like you've learned how to do it. <laughs> it does look like that. I mean, you know, I feel like I can, I'm always sort of mapping out my exit strategy, what I'm gonna use as a weapon. That could go in your gullet, you know what I mean? But <laughs> no one's threatened me today. When you walked into this friendly environment, this <laughs> talk show where you've been invited, you actually thought, if trouble broke out, this could go into Conan's throat. <laughs> if you went rogue. Now, how do you take Andy out? You know, you've used this on me. How does Andy go? I, you, no, I'd be on the floor <laughs> crying. <laughs> yeah. He's not. Please don't hurt me. Kill him some more. <laughs> you, um, it's interesting because uh, in the movies, you're required to drive and be an expert driver in the movies, but you don't drive in real life. I don't. That's the magic of movies, though, isn't it? Yeah, but I'm curious, is it difficult to pretend you drive? Yeah. Even, even though you're, you're a very good actress, is it hard to pretend you drive when you don't drive? Well, yeah, and the thing is, I don't normally use a machine gun either, and for some reason, I don't, <laughs> I don't have as much trouble with that. It's just... So the, it's easier to fake the machine gun. Yeah. What's hard about faking? driving. I don't, and I feel like such a fraud. I think because also you're usually driving along and having a sort of intense conversation with somebody and I always have to be told, no, Kate, you have to look at the road occasionally because I forget, you know, you're supposed to look where you're going in a yeah, car. You know, I'm right. not used to that and wing mirrors and clicky things. And I mean, not that my character indicates Clicky much, things? What kind of car are you driving? I am not driving anything. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, so that I can feel a bit silly in that. And we, it was harder this time because we had, we had two very lovely Swedish directors and all the... All the car stuff was a green screen with them on a loud halo with quite a thick accent and also me being completely stupid about driving. So, so they were yelling uh, directions to you yeah. while you were trying to pretend that you knew how to drive. You have two <laughs> Swedish men yelling at you. Yeah, I'm sort of pretend, no, pretend a monster is coming and things like that, you know, because obviously there wasn't a real right. monster. And then at one point they shouted, lift up your shin, lift up your shin. So I'm sort of sitting there kind of like, what's that for? And, and they meant shin. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that scene where you're driving like this. No, I don't know. It's a terrific scene. Um, we have a clip here, an action uh, scene uh, from the film. Anything we need to know for this? I believe this I is you uh, using explosives. I think I might be blowing up an elevator shaft. Blowing up an something you do in real life. Uh, let's take a look at this clip from uh, Underworld Awakening. Wait for my cue. I'm ready.